Mike Fires making his second start of the season, continuing to try to build off the foundation he laid with his last outing against Baltimore. A couple of line drives by the Jays, and they have two on and nobody out. So here's Guerrero is batting 347. This one's popped up. Murphy turns around, flips the mask away, and he's got it. So Guerrero not happy, and Fires gets a big out. That is a huge out early in the ball game. So here's Gritchick. And a big overhand curve drops in there. Strike three call. Grichik knew it. So, a couple of Blue Jays stranded in the top of the first. Hunjin Ryu will come back and makes his return from a short stint on the injured list. Canna leads off for the ace spot over the first. Canna deep to left field. And that baby's gone. Well, Canna got something he liked for the first time in his career. A leadoff home run deep down the left field line just inside the foul pole. So the A's grab a one nothing lead and Vigio delivers the Blue Jays third hit. So here's Jonathan Davis. Canna hustling in Mark Canna tracks it down. So this is Danny Jansen the catcher. Puts it up the middle. That's Kemp. And Kemp throws out Jansen, and that'll do it. An infield hit here in the second. One down now, and the batter is the right fielder, Stephen Piscotti. 3 2, ground ball down to third, to second one. On to first in time. Biggio to Simeon, to Guerrero to turn the double play and end the inning. So 2 1 with nobody out, and it doesn't get any easier with Vlad Guerrero standing in. Swing and a miss, struck it off. Throw to first, and they got him. Bichette gets picked off first base after the strikeout. So you wanted a double play? Not conventional, but it'll work. And a couple of men on now for Randall Gritchick. 1-1, and a swing and a high fly ball. Well hit. Left field, and it's gone. Gritchick with a three-run homer. And the Blue Jays have taken the lead here in the third. There's that power I was talking about. There's plenty of power in his in his bat. He'll cut his swing down when he needs to. He'll go the other way when he needs to. But if you make a mistake and he's locked in, this is what's going to happen. So here is Olsen. Does not have a hit in this series. He's hit a little bit of a skid. And he smokes this one toward the right field corner. That'll get down. Goes up and over the wall on a bounce. So Kemp's going to score, but Loriano's going to have to stop at third. So unfortunately, the ball bouncing up over the wall may have cost the A's a run on the Olsen hit, but they do get one in. Now the A's have a chance to tie it and take the lead if they can get a base hit by Murphy. Loriano walking down the line at third. That one is hooked. Fair ball. Two runs are going to score. Murphy is going to make a big turn and hold at first, and the A's take a 4-3 to three lead. Guriel made a nice play, hustling it down toward the corner to keep Murphy to a single, but two runs were going to score no matter what. Danny Jansen, the batter. Jansen lifts one, left field, deep and gone. Danny Jansen with his first home run of the season, and the Blue Jays go back on top. Good for Danny. Just keep swinging, young man. Belt high pitch, and Jansen shows you that, hey, I can still hit. Now Bo's got to gather himself back up. Little jam shot to the right side. Can Fires get over before Bo? He cannot. Bichette will dive into first with an infield hit. So that's going to do it for Fires. So Guerra making his 10th appearance, 1 0 with a 2.25 ERA. 2 2 pitch to Grichik from Guerra. And that one's hit well the left center field. Canna hustling back. Canna's going to get there, and he makes the catch. So here's Loriano with two outs here in the bottom of the fifth. Loriano, line drive the right field at a base hit. And the ball gets past Hernandez. So Loriano's going to be able to scoot. He hits the bag at second. He's headed for third. Katze puts up the stop sign. And Loriano stands at third base with two outs. As Matt Olson hits, it's a 5-4 game, so the A's could make that air by Hernandez really hurt the Blue Jays if Olson can get Loriano home. 
One, two, and he got him. Swing and a miss to get Olsen and strand the runner at third. And at the end of five, the Blue Jays still have the lead. If base is loaded and just one out. They ask her 0 for 1, and he's walked twice. And he lines the ball into center field. A base hit. Simeon in to score. Bichette in to score. Vladdy will stop at second. And the Blue Jays now lead 7 to 4. The lead is now three. First and second, Randall Gritchett. Crossed him up with a fastball, and Randall's going to line it up the alley in right center. Guerrero rounding third. He is in to score. Teoscar rounding third. He is in to score. The throw goes to nobody over near the third base dugout. And Grichik will take third as the Blue Jays now lead 9 to 4. And he would have scored if Sergio Romo didn't hustle over there. That ball was heading into the dugout. Sergio looks like he might have hurt himself as he comes up limping. First, he knows that's going to cost him a run if he doesn't knock that ball down. And he might have hurt himself when he slid to get that ball. Just saves it before it goes into the dugout. I can tell you right now, just with the mentality of Sergio Romo, if he can stand up, he'd like the opportunity to try to continue to to work. He says he's fine. That play on Gritchick goes as a a double, two RBIs, and an error on the throw coming in. Slowly hit. Olson has it. He's going to have to take it himself, and he beats very well to the bag. And that's how it ends. So Sergio Romo not moving around all that great. Sergio Romo doesn't look like he's feeling all that great as he heads up to the clubhouse. So Ramin Goudouin is the new pitcher for the A's. Marcus Simeon, three for four today, six for 15 in the series against his former team at the top of the order. And now Simeon drills the ball deep down the left field line and gone. What an afternoon for Marcus Simeon, and it is 10 for Blue Jays. That was textbook how to hit that ball in. High amps walks Piscotti on four pitches to extend it a little bit as Elvis Andrews steps in now for Oakland. One two and Andrews has popped it up. Simeon battling the sun finds it at the last moment it makes the catch and the Blue Jays will beat the A's for the second day in a row. 